Explain, hi Ben. Um, what uh, what is it that you're actually doing on telly tonight? Right. So tonight we're going to be in a chamber. We're going to locked up, shackled up. That chamber's going to fill with water. We're going to hold our breath and try and escape the shackles, then escape the top of the chamber whilst holding our breath, without hopefully anything bad happening live tonight. This is a this is a historically very dangerous trick. Yeah. So the whole water torture escape uh, is good. Dates Houdini and people before that have tried loads. A lot of magicians have had bad accidents doing this. So we thought let's put our own spin on this. I've never seen it where you get put in a room and that room is filled up. Mm. That's a different kettle of fish altogether. Uh, so Ben, this was your idea. I yeah. understand. You're a magician. Yeah. I know that you asked a lot of celebrities <laughs> to get involved, didn't you? And understandably, a lot of people would say no, because it's, it's terrifying. Joey? I don't even know why I said yes, to be honest. <laughs> well, I just, I, now. Honest, honestly, I, honestly fit, fit, like there's been moments and I thought, I, I, I don't know if I can do it. Like, it, it's, it is terrifying, I'm not going to lie. Did you, did you know what escapology was? No, nah, not at all. <laughs> um, but it, there, I mean, there, was, there was loads of little ideas floating about, and this, this, this was something I said yes to all of them, so... When someone said that it's escapology, did you think that that was a way of saying sorry? Um, I, didn't really, I didn't really have a clue what it meant. I just knew that there was potential of me drowning, but I'm a risk taker, so I'm just, I'm just going to take the risk. It is what it is. This is the ultimate risk, and it's going to be live on television tonight, which is absolutely terrifying. Joey is in charge of both sets of locks. Well, am I? I haven't told you this. No, so, I'm, not doing, I'm not doing you as well, mate. So I haven't told you this. So basically, Joey, uh, we taught Joey how to pick locks the last few days, and you've been doing very well. I'm, I'm, so, all, I'm all right here. So the way, and you've not been to the chamber yet, you've not seen how it works, but the way the setup is, I'm going to be lower in the chamber than you are. So that means I'm going to go underwater before you. Okay. But my hands are going to be shackled, so I can't start doing anything until you get out of your locks and then get out me, get me out. So now you're putting your life in my hands? Yes. Mate, and remember, this is ridiculous. If you're not quick, I'm going to be under there, literally needing air. So that's what we're going to do. The thing is, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not a magician or a stuntman. I'm just a human, normal human. Well, the thing mean? Is... He's, like, he's, like, he's, he's like some sort of alien who can, he can do things. Joey, I, we, you know, we've known each other for a very long time. Yeah. And, uh, and I know that you're, you know, you're not brilliant at paying attention. I'm terrible. Um, and you're not brilliant when it comes to um, how long you're interested in stuff. Mm. So I can't imagine how difficult it must have been to grab your attention enough to teach you this. Yeah. Are you, do you feel confident that you fully understand what you've got to do? Not really. I don't really. No, I, really? I've just been, what I've been doing is I've been trying to take like every like hour as it comes, just sort of like... I'm sort of just... I'm just sort of... I'm not winging it. Oh, please don't wing as, it. As please we're, don't as do we're coming more As we're coming more up to the stunt, I'm, I'm trying harder. I'm not going to lie. Like, I've not, I have been trying hard. You've, you've worked, and we've but... had to change the way I would normally teach somebody. So, for example, we realised with Joe, when he's focusing but... on other things, like song lyrics, he can hold his breath for longer. So you're sing he's singing songs in so his head. So now I'm rapping in my head. Mm -hmm. I'm rapping, like, different songs in my uh, head what, slowly. What are you rapping? Um, <laughs> just, just out just, of curiosity. Just a song by Little Pump. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's a rapper. <laughs> um, what made you uh, what made you settle on on this trip? Because as we said before, this is a uh, it's a it's a very famous, historically very mm -hmm. dangerous one. I think Harry Houdini died on Halloween, didn't he? Nineteen uh, did not 19... through, not through this. Had but... peritonitis, did he? Yes, he did. Oh, which that was nineteen twenty six. Yes. Okay. And he died. Well, the, the mystery of his death is people wondered he was in such good shape. But he used to do a thing uh, where he could get anyone from an audience to come up on stage and hit him as hard as he can. And one night, someone caught him off guard and he was a professional boxer and ruptured all his uh, internal organs and he died in hospital a few days later. So, yeah, Houdini is famous for Halloween. It's obviously... It's, and also realising, speaking to people, so many people have a fear of water yeah. and being underwater. Yeah, that's yeah. me. I, honestly, I hate water so much. Right. I so... really do. What, what, what's alarming me is that uh, you're hearing a lot of the facts now when we're on the sofa and this is happening tonight. Yeah, but it's yeah. best not to overload him, isn't it? It's Do you think to... so? Yeah. Do you think... What, what made... I wish we could have just done this in one day and not thought about it so much. I know we've had five days training, but, yeah, but in a way, do... it's like, what's the point? You, you can't, can't you... do a death-defying stunt I'm in not... one day. Walk in, Joey Essex but... comes in, learns how to pick a lock and saves your life in a day. Well, two, I wouldn't get in there. There were, time, there were times <laughs> earlier in the week where you went, oh, I'll just be all right on the night. I'll just be all right. I'm like, no, 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 we need to... I think five days has been way too less to learn this stunt, so yeah. I think should, we should have done at least a month. Did you get, yeah. did you get lifted up? Um, you have to go high? No, so, so we're it's gonna, all we on the ground. Locked down well, yeah. and the floor's filling. Because I'm just I thinking think we're about... 100 foot underground. So, Actually, so yeah, you yeah, go yeah. down. Into so Because yeah. I'm thinking about your fears, because you mm -hmm. are quite claustrophobic. Oh, yeah, right? massively, yeah. So you don't like closed-in spaces. No. Nope. Um, and you mentioned just very briefly there your, your fear of water. Yeah. Um, so much so that you don't like... Baths. I don't like baths. I don't like swimming. 
Um, I don't like anything. I just don't really, just don't really like being underwater, really. Uh, Never so have. Obviously, this is a big risk for you. Then. Yeah, it is massively. Yeah. Uh, why this? What, what, what made you when you when you got that phone call and Ben was like, I really want you <coughs> to do this. This is, you know, you're the guy for me. Um, what, what made you say yes? I've, I've just always liked to overcome my fears. If something, I, I like mind over matter. Like even when I did the jungle, there were so much situations mm -hmm. that I really didn't want to do. I didn't want to jump yeah. out of a helicopter. I didn't want to eat a kangaroo's testicle. Like all those sort of things. They are. They are difficult, but it's mm -hmm. mind over matter, and you, I just, it just feel like it, you come out the, the other side stronger. Mm -hmm. So for me, this is a huge thing that if it does go well and you push I succeed it, I'll be very happy with myself. So and you're the kind, I'm learning about Joey. Joey's the kind of person you know that kind of flight, fight or flight kind of mentality. Mm -hmm. Joey's the kind of person you put him in the deep end some with something, and I think something just kicks in with yeah. you. And it sets in. So fingers crossed, that's exactly what we need for tonight. You're a big Halloween fan anyway, aren't you? Massive, love it. Yeah, it's magic pranks. Halloween, it's great. It's just basically just scaring people's fun, isn't it? This is Halloween, day. you're supposed to, so yeah.